Okay. Uh, you're right here. You're right there. Okay, yeah, yeah. So strip number six, Cypher. Right here, right here. See the big numbers on the wall? There it is. And this is the strip. Okay. We're going to work on a little bit of setting up counter attacks today. Okay, kind of go through different ways to make a counter attack. Doesn't matter for now. That's okay. So, Patricia. Huh? Yes. I don't know. You have to find it. Yes. <laughs> okay. So, we're going to start with sucking in our opponent. So, opponent, in my case, I'm moving in and out. On my step forward, Patricia is going to do a half step towards me and lift up the tip, exposing her hand. Okay, so up and back foot shoots out. So front foot, back foot. Good. At some point in time, I bite on it. I reach. You make a stop hit. Your job is to turn on the light. Because we're plugged in, you as the opponent, you actually make a lunge and see if you can make the hand hit. If you make it, your light should be the one that turns on. Okay, so try it again. Up. You provoke, I simply move in and out, up, I reach, stop, hit, that's your hit. So bait them out by showing the bottom of your hand. Okay? Let's go. Try it out. It's all good. Okay, so masks on. Cypher, come here. Sophia is going to be here, right? She's going to be stepping forward, step forward, Sophia, and lifting up the hand. When you see the hand open up, you lunge and try to hit her on the hand. And she's going to try to hit you on the arm. Okay? So we do that five times each. All right, lunge out. Good. That's right. So you do five attempts, and then you switch rows. Five attempts each. Okay, let me see, girls. So provoke it. So you got to show the target here, right? So you're going to step forward and lift up the hand so she has something to go under. Yeah, there you go. Where's the hit? There it is. That's the hit. So you do five attempts and then switch rolls. Good. That's it. Try to make those top hits. Okay. Oh, she got you on it, right? <laughs> But, okay, the idea is not to pin her down. Like, you make sure you have some space to actually work with. Okay? Yeah, but it's a drill. You're not supposed to actually. Judy, Patricia, focus. Let's go. Ain't nobody seen this. There it is. It's a little better view. Now you see the camera, right? Good job. Yes, let's see it. There's a hit. And up. So, so be careful, right? You can't just have your arm out there because people will pick you off on it. Just until I stop. So it's the stop. Okay, stop. It's okay. You both had a chance to try it? No. It's okay. Similar idea. Again, I'm moving in and out. This time, Lutza is going to go through showing different targets. So we understood the idea that we present the target. We can present different targets. So one time, Lutza will step forward, showing the bottom of her hand. I commit. You still make your stop hit, right? Next time, Lutza, instead of showing her hand, she can lose, look to show her body. She's going to do a step forward and pull her arm a little towards herself. Oh, so I have to go a little further out. So you make a stop hit that way. In case if I do a flesh. And lastly, Luta steps forward and shows me her toe. As I go for the toe hit, you make a stop hit. Okay? So that's the drill. So instead of just being the hand, we show one on the hand, one on the body, one on the toe, and then anticipate for the stop hit. Okay? Go ahead. Try it out. Couple hits. Okay, so same thing, guys, right? You show once on the hand, one on the leg, and one on the, sh on the shoulder. Okay. 
No, so you step to one. Judy, you show her the hand. You make one phrase happen with the hand situation. After that, okay, you say somebody got a light. Only next time you look to bait out the actual shoulder. Okay, that's a hit. Yeah, yeah, so if you try to land that head, that's the idea is right. Good. So at some point in time, your job was to lunge out, right, Cypher? So you see, you see Sophia has given you an opening. At some point in time, your job is to lunge out and try to hit it. Yeah, be ready, yeah. Sofia, to be treble contra attack was a little You need to counter attack in this one, right? So you hit over top. You showed she comes, you hit over the top. Uh, that's the idea. Okay, good job. Salute, we're gonna rotate one spot clockwise. Uh, Cypher, stay plugged in as you are. We're gonna just rotate this way. So stay plugged in, yeah? And Sophia, over here. So we're gonna just rotate it out this way. This way everybody gonna be with everybody. Yeah, plug in, and you two plug in. Okay, this time, instead of it being a uh, body part that we're opening up, we're going to look to bait out the blade. Okay, so on guard, Patricia. So, Patricia, what she's going to do, she's going to give me just a half extension looking for me to carry the blade, right? And a lot of pistol grippers will look to touch. What we're going to do this time, instead of it being an anticipated disengage, we're going to look to do anticipated remise. So as I go forward, as soon as I do beat four and extend, that's when Patricia's going to soften up and look to get a stop hit before I actually get to her. Okay? So we're simply moving in now. You present. Good. I beat and I go towards her. Your job is to make a hit before I hit you. Right? So the key here is for Patricia just to give half the arm. As soon as the blade of hers gets touched, she extends out with a little angulation. That's right. So again, you bait. Good. I might beat and make a hit. Patricia scores a hit. And then in reverse, right? So I'll bait out to Patricia. She beats four, and I instantly look to make a remise around on the wrist. It works especially well if somebody makes a beat and flashes at you. That's how you pick them up. Okay? So go ahead. Try it out. Five attempts one person and five attempts the other person. Hunter Dennis, you guys can plug in and fence. We have one strip here available. Yes. So, Luta, your job is when you faint and only a little bit of your arm gets extended. Judy, come a little closer. When Judy beats it, you absorb it and then extend and make a hit. It's a, almost like a premeditated remise, but on the wrist instead of it being on the body. Huh? Try to work it. Yes, that was much better, Luta. The key is not actually to get away. The key is to absorb with your arm and create that opening. Mm -hmm. So, Cypher, it's okay. Good effort. When you fake... Isa beats, you're going to go out making an angle, and when Isa extends going for the hit, this is where potentially you have a hit, right? Just right on the inside of the bell guard. So you're just kind of absorbing her beat and trying to go around. Oh. Yeah, Judy, that's quite good, actually. Very nice, Judy. 
Patricia, you gotta get on guard, right? So opponent is lunging out, so you gotta absorb that. Sam Fraser with a little hop and make an angle. I should have tried it. Everybody tried it. Patricia, you're not really working on anything. You're just standing here like this, trying to absorb it. The idea is you got to be an athlete. You have a point of the flesh and you're full speed. Why are we doing these drills? They're supposed to help you at the bloody tournament. Not just standing here like a mannequin doing something. Okay. Very good. Good. Sophia. Oh. Okay. Last one is going to look to do kind of second intention. As I'm moving around on my step forward, Sophia will take eight with a little half step. So half step towards me. As soon as I look to disengage, make a hit, instead of a parry, today is a counterattack, right? I disengage and a step back and leave a counterattack on this side. So with a step back. Good. And then next time, Sophia is going to take seven. So instead of, that's eight again, you're going to just go on the inside like this. Seven. And similar idea. As soon as I look to come over the top, she's going to hit me with a stop hit in the sixth position. Okay? So you, in order to set it up, one time take eight. Take eight. As soon as the opponent, don't parry. Take eight. As soon as I disengage, step back and stop it. Good. Next time, take seven. Up. As soon as I come over the top, step back, stop here. Very good. Okay? Go ahead. Give it a try. So you're going forward, right? She takes eight. Sophia took eight. Now you disengage and step forward. Yes, that's right. That's what Sophia... You can go try to hit her. You guys are dressed. Yeah. Oh, you lost your tip. Okay, that's unfortunate. No, you're parrying, Judy. It's a stop hit. Right? So take eight. Yeah. Step back. Stop hit right in here. Yes, on the inside of it. That's right. Hello, everybody. Can we see? If you can still see, that's impressive. Patricia, you're still in the shot. You're doing good. Ow. That's right. That's right. If you want to be good at fencing, you're going to reverse engineer as the coach. Yeah, so disengage that cypher. So when Issa took eight, you disengage. Cypher, bring it up. Yeah, and then your stop hit is on the inside in here. So you're setting up your opponent. You're making them feel comfortable. And then when they flash, you get them. Okay. Very good. So what we're going to do is we're going to put that into a little action. We're going to have... One person, one side that has the lead, the other side has to attack them. In order to defend, you can only make stop hits. Okay, so we're going to do two bows to, let's say, three points. One bow, this side starts with a 1-0 lead. You guys go into three points, so it's on you to try to maintain the lead by making stop hits. Then, however, it finishes, this side will start with a 1-0 lead, going to three points. And you can only make stop hits. So the person that has the lead at the start, you can only make stop hits. If you if you beat them, if it becomes 2-1, the bout is over. Okay? So if I start with the bout, if I'm losing to Judy 1-0, she can only make stop hits. If I make two effective attacks in a single line, so it becomes 2-1, that's it. I win the bout. I don't have to even go to three points. Okay? Let's go. Start it up. Huh? 
Є якась шпага, яка може зробити? А що ж таке це без тої зброєю? А це точно шпага чи це шнур? You can start! You guys can decide. You both have to do two bouts. It doesn't matter. Окей. Перевіряємо шнур. Два коротких замикаємо. Шнур працює, шпага ні. Такі от пироги.